welcome to Pickleball and Beyond. My name is Ryan. My name is Vino. And today we actually have a special treat. We got to review the Vulcan V570, yes. which is soon to be released. your thoughts you know the first thing I think everybody would agree is the surface on this thing is ridiculous what the TNT textured and traction surface you're just touching it I mean it's it is this ridiculous interesting gritty feel yes. it's very similar to like the T700 carbon feel but it, it, it it's just got this really it weird is, texture it is so texturized it's unbelievable so one thing I'd wonder is you know we've only gotten to use this uh, for today yeah is how that would hold up over time. Uh -huh. That'd be yes. a good question to yes. find out, but yes. boy, out of the box, this thing is just incredible. I've never seen a surface like that, honestly. I mean, just even taking it out, it really looks a fine looking paddle. Both, like you have the white and you have the black. Um, it's beautiful, it really is beautiful. Very well balanced, yep. just holding it. I really, like, I mean, take and just play it straight out of the box. Yep. No needing to adapt at all. Yeah, um, the adaptability part, I mean, yeah. We, jumped in both are playing good so the only thing that would take some time to get used to for some players could be the very long handle it, it has a long handle very long handle. and if you like a longer reach but don't want an elongated shape yep or if awesome. you like the two-handed backhand so we've yes, seen, yes we had a friend of ours just she was hitting the two-handed backhands i saw lots of really good drives if, you know if you're a player that utilizes that shot a lot this could be a really good option okay so let's start off with control so what the, were your thoughts? Yeah, the control on this paddle, we've noticed with a lot of Vulcan paddles, they have a lot of control. Um, when we were dinking with it, boy, I, I love the way it felt. It felt like a very the, the high. The Vulcan 16mm paddle, and yep. I've now tried quite a few. Yep. The control in the 16mm Vulcan are it's just great. out of this world. It's great. I mean, I think it, it goes, like, the, the, the preference then goes to the shape and the feel and the yep. length of the panel. Yep. But in general, the 16mm yeah. paddles in the Vulcan, the control is awesome. And this lived up to that reputation. Yes. Um, speed ups. Um, speed up, speed ups. As far as um resets, um, you know, when you're hitting at a hard or hitting that very hard at me, you know, another gets another just great job. I yeah, mean, uh, you can reset with you this can reset like it very system. well. When you were when you were driving yeah. and I was resetting, and the same goes the other way around. Yeah. We were able to bring everything back. Yes. It felt very similar to one of our favorite Balkans, which is the nine. Uh, to be 940, right? Yes. Actually, even the shape of it is extremely similar. Like, if you look at the shape, yeah. it's it's very much similar, similar. to the 940. Um, and the resets were. What about the power in it? Boy, I mean, looking at the handle, you know that's gonna have a lot of power. <laughs> and the surface. I mean, it had tons of power. I mean, it, it had very it had that hammer effect. Yes. Like, if you brought it down yep. because of the length and the shape, yep. and it had, had this really nice sweet spot. Um, higher up, yep. so you were able to kind of control that power as well, which I really enjoyed. Yep. Just can jump into the spin side of things. So, I mean, we know it's going to have a lot of spin, and you know, it lived up to it. it I think, like the the little while that we have been reviewing paddles, like we have seen really textured paddles. Yep. But when you go and hit it, like you don't generate that same amount of spin. And I think while we were playing, you talked mentioned this, like you know, especially those small slower balls. Yep. You know, you don't have to give too much to generate that spin. Yes. If you hit it properly, you generate that spin. So, if you're looking for a nice spinny paddle, you know, this definitely is up there. Yes. Not, not, not as much as my favorite 940. I was going to say, so, I think we should compare yes, these yes, to the I think that's a good one. So, yes, yes. you mentioned the spin part. I would agree that probably has a touch more spin, but for me, what I noticed more was uh, forgiveness on the yes. V940 and the resets. It just has that extra level more, but yeah. I mean, you're paying for it. The, yes. Uh, I mean, price difference, I believe, I this believe is, it's an $80 difference. Yes. Yes. This is going to be listed at $149. Yep. And this is a $230 paddle. Yep. So when you nitpick that, you yep. do feel the difference. There are yep. just, this lives up just a smidget more, yep. a little bit more spin. I mean, I've not been able to control anything from the baseline as much as I've been able to control yep. this. You can hit as hard as you want. I'm able to get it exactly where I want it. But this is just a level or two less. 
Yep. But it lives but it's there. Very it, high. It's right there, it, right? It's, it's, it's a like, high bar. Oh. Yeah, it's a high bar, but it, it gets it the gets job done. It gets very close. Yeah. And adaptability, just touching back on it, from the second ball, yep. we were playing with it like it was yeah. our own time. Yeah, <laughs> I, would, I agree. Well balanced, yeah. like just the same way that we felt with the 940. Yep. Immediately playing with it, it was just a fun paddle to play yes. with, and like you know, we kept on. I mean, the difference between these two, but yeah. we close they the feel, eyes. Yeah, they feel they feel very they similar. They feel very similar, yes. play similar as far as the control, power. I mean, every category, the feel. I mean, I wouldn't have known that we we didn't even realize there was a difference yes, for yes, a little. Yes. So so to learn more. We, we were very excited. Of course, we're going to play more and see how it how it stands with time, right? I yes. think that's going to be some, uh, a key. Um, anyone wants to demo it, please reach out to us. More than happy to yes. demo these paddles. Um, thank you for joining us. Um, yeah, we'd like to thank Chip Shots for letting us use their facility once again. Um, they have three very nice courts, and uh, we enjoy testing our paddles here. Today. So thanks everyone for joining. Thank you very much.